Steve Bartman received a 2016 World Series ring, 14 years after being singled out for costing the Chicago Cubs a chance to advance to the World Series. The Cubs issued a statement Monday stating their intentions for Bartman, who has lived a private life since fans verbally bombarded him for accidentally interfering with left fielder Moises Alau on a foul ball in Game 6 of the 2003 National League Championship Series that helped change the fortunes of the playoffs and enabled the Miami Marlins to win the NLCS in seven games and win the series. On behalf of the entire Chicago Cubs organization, we are honored to present a 2016 World Series championship ring to Mr. Steve Bartman, the Cubs said in a statement. We hope this provides closure on an unfortunate chapter of the story that has perpetuated throughout our quest to win a long-awaited World Series. While no gesture can fully lift the public burden he has endured for more than a decade, we felt it was important Steve knows he has been and continues to be fully embraced by this organization. After all he has sacrificed, we are proud to recognize Steve Bartman with this gift today. Bartman, who was harassed by Cubs fans after the incident in 2003, also issued a statement on Monday. Although I do not consider myself worthy of such an honor, I am deeply moved and sincerely grateful to receive an official Chicago Cubs 2016 World Series championship ring. I am fully aware of the historical significance and appreciate the symbolism the ring represents on multiple levels. My family and I will cherish it for generations. Most meaningful is the genuine outreach from the Ricketts family, on behalf of the Cubs organization and fans, signifying to me that I am welcomed back into the Cubs family and have their support going forward. I am relieved and hopeful that the saga of the 2003 foul ball incident surrounding my family and me is finally over. I humbly receive the ring not only as a symbol of one of the most historic achievements in sports, but as an important reminder for how we should treat each other in today's society. My hope is that we all can learn from my experience to view sports as entertainment and prevent harsh scapegoating and to challenge the media and opportunistic profiteers to conduct business ethically by respecting personal privacy rights and not exploit any individual to advance their own self-interest or economic gain. Moreover, I am hopeful this ring gesture will be the start of an important healing and reconciliation process for all involved. To that end, I request the media please respect my privacy, and the privacy of my family. I will not participate in interviews or further public statements at this time. Words alone cannot express my heartfelt thanks to the Ricketts family, Crane Kenny, Theo Epstein, and the entire Cubs organization for this extraordinary gift, and for providing the city of Chicago and Cubs fans everywhere an unforgettable world championship in 2016. I am happy to be reunited with the Cubs family and positively moving forward with my life. Former Cubs pitcher Ryan Dempster spoke about Bartman's ring while attending Joe Madden's celebrity golf outing. I guess that is closure at its finest, he said. When I think about the Ricketts, family, they are like the classiest, nicest people. To do something like that for Steve Bartman, who got ridiculed for something that any fan would have done, is pretty